Welcome to another day of algebra. Today we'll be solving the system by elimination. Our first equation in our system is 5x plus 7y equals negative 11, and our second equation is 2x plus 3y equals negative 4. Since our y's least common multiple is 21, and our x's least common multiple is 10, we'll be eliminating the x's. So we want the coefficient to be positive or negative 10. That means for the first equation, we have to multiply it by negative 2. When we do that, we get negative 10x minus 14y equals 22. And then in our second equation, we have to multiply that by 5. This gives us 10x plus 15 equals negative 20. Now we can take our equations and combine them. So negative 10x minus 14y equals 22 and 10x plus 15y equals negative 20. Our x's cancel. Our y's give us 1y equals 2. Now we can take 2 and plug it back into one of our other equations to solve for x. When we do that, we get 2x plus 6 equals negative 4. We subtract 6 to the other side and get 2x equals negative 10. So x equals negative 5. So our solution for our system is negative 5, 2. Now we can graph our lines to see what our system looks like. This is our first equation in y-intercept form, but what we can do is take our point and check it in our equation to see if it works. So it's true that negative 25 plus 14 equals negative 11. So what we can do is plot that point and then start from there and find more of our points using our slope. We connect those points and there's our first line. In our second line, we can find our x-intercept, which is negative two, and our slope and graph it from there. So we plot negative two, then go down two and over three, down two and over three. And there's our second line. We see that our lines are fairly close, but they only cross at one point, at negative 5, 2.